Welcome back to my channel guys. Today we are camping in Ram River, Alberta and this place is absolutely gorgeous. Just check out the scenery. Oh my goodness, right? And a local actually showed us this spot uh, for camping. We we're just right back over there and uh, we are gonna be in some crappy area but he showed us the way. We're right by the stream. This is absolutely amazing. Hey, if you're not subscribed already, what are you waiting for? Hit that button, hit it now. And while you're at it, hit that bell. Be a part of the notification gang. So our campsite's right next to the river and we decided to put some rocks up here and make a makeshift cooler. The water's nice and cold and it keeps our drinks ice cold. It is awesome. So this is where my buddy Nino got stuck in his truck. As you can see, it's not a crazy incline. So maybe next time we either bring a 4x4 or Nino can stop making stupid decisions. Funny, but stupid. Oh yeah! We're hiking around the Ram Falls Provincial Park. There's a cool little stream right over here. Yo guys, so we just left Ram Falls, Alberta and now we are heading off to Banff. We're taking this uh, logging road it's pretty damn bumpy. Kim's driving over here, so we'll see you guys in Banff. So there's a giant rut in the middle of the road of that logging trail. And as you see, we happen to bottom out. But luckily we only hit the cross member and not the oil pan. So we will continue off to Banff. Hey guys, so we are here at Egg Smart Band, Alberta, and we met up with uh, Kevin Irene over here, and of course, little Yuki. Yuki, say hi. Look, she's so cute. Yuki, say hi. So cute. Oh, yay. All right, so I got the avocado locks, and Kim got the salmon Benny. Mmm. We're here at Tunnel Mountain doing this light two hour hike. We'll see you at the top. friends told us it was going to be about a two hour hike, but it turns out it was only about half an hour. But check out this view. Mm -hmm. 
So we can't go to Banff and not visit our favorite sushi place. It's called Sushi House. And so what we have here is we got some gyoza, some spicy shrimp salad maki, some eel and cucumber maki, a lulu tuna don, and a bunch of nigri. Bit of a casualty over here. Yeah, so time to chow down. Good morning guys, so today we're at Grotto Canyon Trail and it's about a 7.1 kilometer hike or four and a half miles. I'm here with uh, my friends David and Jody. They're over this way. Hi. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys at the end. So I think we found where the water source came from. Man, this is pretty nice. Wow, we found a hidden gem. Look at all these stacked rocks here. We are the first ones here in over a thousand years. That's sarcasm. Stacks on stacks on stacks on stacks. Hey guys, so I think we reached the end of the trail. Um, over there, there's just a bunch more rock and for the past two kilometers, there hasn't been any signs. So we're gonna head back to the car and uh, go grab some lunch. We're here in Camor, Alberta at Hogshead. And I got the bison burger with the soup. And Kim's just stuff in her face. Good morning, guys. So today we are here at Barrier Lake and uh, we're hoping to rent some canoes to do some canoeing for a couple hours and then we're gonna head over for lunch maybe get some tacos and then uh, I believe the next thing we have planned is a hike in Grassy Lakes so uh, we'll see you out on the water You guys just chilling? Just chilling. Just chilling like a villain? About to crash. <laughs> oh my god, go away. <laughs> we are here at Cabiza Grande getting a quick lunch. We got some tacos over here. And we started off with the Ocho dip, but we just absolutely crushed it. So yeah. Yo, so we're here at Grassy Lakes doing the trail. It's just a loop around, only about four kilometers, and then we're back at the vehicle, going home, getting some grub, you know? We'll see you guys at the end, top? I don't know, what the hell. Thank you, you saw there. All right, we're going to the more difficult side. Crazy. There's this bridge here. This is where all the water runs down. So I guess that's it. We made it to the end. Um, that little bit of the waterfall was uh, a nice little ending touch. 
Uh, so we're just gonna go back to our hotel and shower off all this sweat. Catch you guys later. So this is Grassy Lakes. Look how crazy this water is. So that other one was the lower lake and this is the upper lake. So crazy. The color is like green, blue, turquoise. All crazy shades. Hey guys, so we're here having dinner at Guacho's in Camor, Alberta. It's a Brazilian barbecue place. And uh, yeah, we are going to get some meat sweats tonight. So because this is Brazilian barbecue and we're in the middle of the pandemic, we can't go and get our own stuff. So we got to choose six different sizes. I only chose four. David and Jody and Kim maxed out their plates. I might get more. And, and David might get more. <laughs> so these are Brazilian cheese bread or cheese balls and they are so good. So fluffy and cheesy inside. I would say that these ones are better than the ones in Edmonton from Pampas. That's what I'm talking about. What I have here is the pecan pie beaver tail, but they come in many different um, shapes and sizes, I guess, and different flavors. So make sure you stop by and grab one before you head out. All right, okay, bye.